Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are doing some little of tips and tricks for the new mode of Fall Guys called Slime Climb Time. If you like this video, or if you're gonna like this video, because obviously you don't know until you're at the end of the video, like, subscribe obviously, and light it up. Alright, tips and tricks for this one. Let's do this. Are you ready? So, obviously we're not in it, but I'll give you a little bit of tips and tricks. Right now. Number one, don't wear tall, tall outfits like a hot dog or the apple towel. Don't do that, alright? It's it giving you three more inches into your height, and you must be thinking, that'd be good. It's not going to help you jump, number one. Number two, if, th if things like want to go across from your head, you might get hit. A little bit <laughs> you know so that's a no-no so just make sure when you all um going about it like you make sure you wear an outfit that won't give you 10 inches with it I right? <laughs> don't you want 10 inches you just you just want their standard height the shorter you are the better he is number two this is random right this is tips and tricks, right? So here we go. Ready? You see that uh, little uh, uh, Doritos, uh, yellow Doritos? You could jump on that to skip this whole part. Like you see other people doing it right now. Jump that to skip the whole part. I'm trying to do it right now, but it's impossible. Oh, but you know I'm not doing it. <laughs> you could jump that ledge, do it too. Another tip and tricks, um, do not go be, do not go with people. You wanna go alone. Or with this one, tips and tricks, just go to the side. Don't, like, what are you, dude, that's not even a challenge. Just go to the side. <laughs> For this one, this tip and trick area, you could jump to go a bit further, a bit, bit faster. To not get slowed down. With this one, you gotta be quick. This one, go, just go, just go. Don't even think, just make sure you go. If you fall, have fun going back up. Because if it's the person there in the middle, you're done. This part, if you, oh, you see that? Look at that, no, 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 no. Ah, ah, you get here. Okay, for this one, you wanna go to the very end. Don't wait, go to the very end and just, yeah, that's it. Just go to the very end, make sure you don't, you have no people around you. The less people you with, the less people you will, you know, fall. Let's put some of the people you fall with. Okay, and um, just just spit up go. <laughs> Make sure just wiggle your way through it. You want to go to the end because well, it, it gives you less time. Obviously, it's more dangerous if you do get hit. But if you go to the end, it's just less like the end of one side. It's, it's just less possible for you to get hit. And make sure. If you just like if you if you see someone ahead of you behind you, just go. Go to the other side to make them more dangerous. And that's it. You see that? You gotta be careful. You gotta be careful. It's like this side you gotta go away from people. They will grab you, they will pull you, they will push you off of this place, and they will make you lose. Like see this Megatron? He know what to do. He know what to do. Tips and tricks. So I already told you about the jump the ledge with the Doritos. In my opinion, jump the ledge. It's more safer. Just jump the ledge, not the Doritos. Just regular jump. That's it. For the logs, you jump. <laughs> you don't get hit by the logs. You jump ahead of time, like two, three seconds ahead of time. And when you hear that gone, just each time you hear it shoot out, just jump. These ones always stay at the end, so you won't get pushed by it. That's it. Wait for the powder on, obviously. For this one, keep jumping, you know, keep jumping. Go a bit further. You could do a little jump part here to go, you to skip that part. But it's pretty difficult because, you know, it's just difficult overall. And you gotta be careful with that. You know, that part is difficult, you know, the initial jump and then jump to the middle. It's kinda hard, you always wanna stay at middle point and try not to get your character to one side. 
This one is, is again slippery, but you know, you could skip the whole part if you jump right here. Make sure you don't, don't get, ah, again, don't go with people, alright? You want to go ahead of people. You want to either wait for the people or go, just straight go, you know, whatever you want to do. See, see that? Go away from people. That's dangerous, don't do that. If you feel dangerous, go ahead. But if you don't feel dangerous and you don't feel confident, don't do it. it, it each, then just, you know, wait. Each time you want slow momentum, go to the side. That's it. If you want to slow your momentum, go to your side. Or go behind to go do it, but you want to, like, you know, you want to rev up. Because slime, you gotta, you know, accelerate a little bit to go faster. If you just accelerate a little bit, you're not gonna get it. That's how you wanna slow down, but still have the momentum to, k if you wanna go, go forward, just you go, go straight ahead. If you complete stop, then go, you might not have enough momentum to go forward, and you might get hit by one of the wrecking balls. Use that yellow Dorito. If you can't really use it, if a lot of people are ahead of you, use the ledge. Use the ledge. Use a ledge. Don't try to stumble. Keep moving your momentum going forward. Don't lose your momentum. Don't you don't want to get hit by the logs? Keep going. Don't let people slow down your momentum. Keep going up. You could do that little jump forward, but honestly, in my opinion, you don't need to. You, I missed that because I was so far behind, so I just didn't want to take that risk to go all the way up. Just do everything perfectly. You could do that again to save up a little bit of time, but it's all worth to be safe than sorry, you know. If you do a risky move, you might risk everything up. You see that? Look, I'm losing time. I could have got up there if I go around. I'm losing more time. Learn the sequence too. Look, okay, so obviously he won. So, I'm done, <laughs> but he did a V of the trick, because if you up in front, number one, to really win this, you gotta be number one, up in front, and then to the left, no, to, yeah, to the left, because you are closer to the Dorito for once, to go do that next jump and go ahead, and now, like, since you're ahead, there's no worries of whether people could, you know, take you on. Like, I didn't, for me, I didn't do no risk, so I could go over there, but if you do risk, you could get to the top as quick as possible, 100%. If you do every shortcut, every jump, every short movement, every leap, you could go up ahead quicker. But, then again, if you fail, you will lose time to it. If you know where to go, and know every jump and know that every position point, you could do it 100%. But if you can't, then oof. Alright, guys, this is it for this tip and tricks video. If you want to see another one, I will give you it. And uh, see you later.